Yo, guys, it's Conviction. I am back. I am playing a coin game against the one, the only, that kid, Kuda. Now, it was a great game. You guys will see right here. Man, I underestimated this guy so freaking much. I also have a couple of new acquisition guys. My biggest one of all is Walter Payton's halfback. I went out. I sold some players. I said, I've got to have Walter Payton. I just have to have him in my life. I need that guy. So we picked him up. Lost a couple players along the way. Got to rebuild my team a little bit more. After I picked him up, I went down to a 91. I'm currently rebuilding. I'm back at a 93 right now. And it's taken forever. I got to run the gauntlet again on a farm account just to get enough coin to buy a new free safety. But look at this. Oh, we should have. We should have actually had that safety right there. That would have been a big play. But he's just going to keep running the ball on me. My team cannot stop the run if you paid them right now. They're just like, eh, it's fine. Run the ball at any point, and we're perfectly fine with it. But it's not fine with me. But I guess that's what happens. Look at that. We get a pick with Jack Ham. I actually sniped that guy for like 16K. No, it's not the ultimate legend. Because if it was, I would have made somebody cry as we throw a pick right here. Stupidly. We had a wide open receiver. We clicked the wrong button. Should have paid attention. And he's got a great user to get the pick. And he's going to test me deep. Nuh-uh. Look at that. What? He got the ball. Honestly, I thought that was a pick. Even watching it a second and third time, I still think it's a pick. I have no idea how he caught that. I'm going to have to go back and watch this another ten times to check that play out. Great user catch by him. As we're going to try to stop the run right here. That's a nice tackle right there. We're going to get a little bit happy about that. But then he gets it right up the middle. This is the first Chris Johnson I've ever seen that does not fumble. That much I have to say. Look, he's going right back to the run game. He's got great moves. Great. He's got great stick moves. That's all I have to say about this kid. And the way he's playing, it's going to be, oh my God, of a game. Oh my Jesus. All right, come on. We got this. We can stop him right here. And we stop him on this play. That's, that's a good thing. That's a good thing. It keeps the game a little bit more interesting. Stop him right here, too. Exactly what I wanted. Give him that third down. Stop him one more time. Keep him to a field goal. We're set. But we cannot stop him. I don't know why. My player's like, no, no, we want him to have the ball. But it's okay. We get the ball back. We're going to try to do something with it. As we had an open receiver and just refused to throw the ball anywhere. We just kept it right there in the middle. We're going to go back to the passing game. We're going to try to cheese him again. We get it. <laughs> we get Patterson. Cordero, Cordell, however you want to announce it. Patterson comes up with the nice catch. We give it back to Peyton. Thankfully, he doesn't fumble because we already had one fumble on us and one pick. It's not looking good for me today as even Denard Robinson's holding on to the ball. That's what I like to see. I also need to get a better, competent backup running back. We're going to go to the triple option cheese, and we give it right to Walter Peyton. The GOAT goes in for the touchdown. Let's go. That's what I like to see. The game is tied up right now. It is looking like a hell of a game again as he's going to get that ball straight through the middle. 35 seconds. Come on, guys. We can't let him drive down the field like this. This is utterly ridiculous to me. It makes us look horrible. But we just got to break his line. I don't know why we can, and we left somebody that wide open. Jesus. Wow, this is insane. But we're going to go right back to it, and we couldn't get the user catch, the swat, the nothing. As he scores and goes up 14-7. We're just going to try getting the ball down the field somehow. Somehow. Come on, timeout, timeout. There we go. Trying everything we possibly can to get back to a tie game as we throw it to Evans, and he comes up with the catch. That was a beautiful catch by Mike Evans. I cannot lie. And we got somebody open, but we overthrow it that bad. That should have been a touchdown and a half. Come on, Bridgewater. That's why you are no longer with the squad. But it's okay because it happens to all of us as we're going to watch him drop back, throw that same route that we cannot cover, and I don't blame him for choosing it. Pick on your opponent's weakest spot and just abuse it. Can't break his line if my life depended on it. And there you go. Just lay some big hits out there, Jack Ham. I mean, I got that 95 Keekly, and he's not doing anything as he gets the same route again. The guy always moves up, breaking tackles all over the place right now. Joe Flacco is throwing dots like he did when he won the Super Bowl. It's insane. That he's got he's got passes everywhere. He's going back to that run game. He's got that Trey Mason. Oh my God, this kid's moves are ridiculous. 
They are freaking ridiculous, man. Goes back to Johnson, going up the middle. I don't even know what to do anymore. I feel like I'm losing all hope already. It's still the third quarter. I'm only down by four. If I can keep him to a field goal, we're set. And he gets into the red zone. Really close in the red zone, too. Eight-yard line. Looks like I need to do something. And I thought that would have been it. I thought that would have been a fumble. That would have put me back in the game. It's going to take a miracle. A complete miracle. Look at this triple option. Come on, Bridgewater. And if it takes a miracle, we get back into this game. We can win it. We'll be set. We'll get 100K richer. We'll be nice. Let's run this next play real quick. Look at that out route. Always wide open on that. Played way too deep. Let's see what I can do here. We have somebody open. We have all Sean Jeffrey deep. Don't press coverage him. Dion cannot press coverage him. Wide open touchdown. There we go. That's what I like to see. Two-point conversion, and he just demolished me. But it's okay. We're, we're still kind of in this game as his moves just, I don't know how he does it. I'm going to have to go take lessons to him on his stick moves. But he's just cutting through my defense like there's no tomorrow. I got to make a stop somewhere, somehow, doing something. And he dropped the ball. All right, one stop, it's our ball. One stop, and it's our ball. Come on. And we can't come up with a stop. Can't come up with nothing. As we're going to fall behind, still 16 to 21, less than two minutes. And we just can't seem to stop him. Stop him right here. All right. We put it at that third and one. And used our timeout, and that's that's game, guys. There's nothing I can possibly do. Thanks for watching the video, and make sure to check out my opponent, that kid Kuda. Like, comment, subscribe. Peace, guys.